Good morning and welcome back with Tumpka. I'm Micah. And I'm Victor, here for your morning announcement. Please pause for a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledge. Attention, Attention salute, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Intent to graduate forms and senior fees are due to Ms. McKenzie by September 1st. Interested in wrestling? If so, see Coach Crockleton in room C11. Student drivers, want parking passes? You need one. They're being sold in the attendance office during lunch or break. Please have your driver's license and proof of insurance, registration, and $20 to buy one. Uh, if you bought a yearbook last year, you can pick them up in room COM 1. I still have mine from last year. Want to see? Yeah, sure. Why not? Extras will be $85. And now for Indian Spotlight. Good morning, WHS. I'm Amber. And I'm Riley. Today we are introducing a new teacher, Miss Duke. Here's Jasmine's interview with her. Hey guys, Jasmine here with your Teacher of the Week, Miss Duke. So, Miss Duke, how many years have you been teaching? This is actually my first year teaching. I came straight out of school, so this is my first high school teaching experience with me being the teacher. Good so, morning. What college did you graduate from? I went to the University of Alabama for my undergrad and majored in biology, so that was a four-year degree, and then I went to AUM for my master's in secondary science education. Um, what made you want to major in science? My high school biology teacher was my favorite teacher, and that was the first time where I actually fell in love with a subject, and then I finally realized that science can literally be applied to any aspect of your life. Um, what drew you to the topic of? During the interview process, um, Dr. Slater was really the only one who was really personal with the interview. And then in talking with everybody before I got a teaching job of where they suggested me to go, everyone said Elmore County and specifically Wetumpka was really great and I've enjoyed being here so far. Oh, that's good. Okay, what do you do on your off time? So a lot of people find this um, kind of funny because they wouldn't expect it, but I love to go fishing. Anytime I get to go fishing, um, I'm just through the roof happy. Um, I also like to go swimming and just being out on the water anywhere. Okay, well, thanks for taking your time to talk with us today. We hope that you have a great year at WHS. Thank you. Today for Student Spotlight, we have Anaya. Here's Casey's interview with her. Hi, Wetumpka. I'm here with our Spotlight student, Anaya. Hey. Anaya is a senior here at Wetumpka High School and also models for multiple shows and photographers. Anaya, when did you start modeling? Um, I started modeling back in the ninth grade, which was like 2014. Nice. Tell us a little bit about why you started modeling. I started modeling just for fun, but once I realized I was actually good at it, I could see myself pursuing it as a career. So. Okay, and do you plan on modeling in college? I do, because there will be more opportunities for me because I'll be older, because right now I'm too young to really do most of the stuff that I want to. So. And what college do you plan on attending next fall? I'm not really sure, but my top three choices are Alabama, Howard, and Philbin. Nice. Okay, and what is the most unique place that you have ever modeled? The most unique place I've been is probably New York Fashion Week. That was really fun. It was a great experience. I will be going back for September. Okay, and lastly, who is your biggest inspiration? My biggest inspiration are my parents because if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be where I am today. They've helped me gone as far as I wanted to in modeling, so I really do what I do for them. Well, thanks, Anaya. This has been our Spotlight Student of the Week, Anaya. Stay tuned for sports. Good morning, it's Tumka High School. Welcome to Sports Talk. I'm Lauren. And I'm Lucas. Our Athlete of the Week is Lakin L from the Tumka Varsity Dance Team. Here's our interview. All right, this is Lakin with our Athlete of the Week. So, Lakin, how would you describe the atmosphere before a dance performance? A lot of the times, we don't even notice the atmosphere because you have so much nerves and adrenaline. Okay, so what advice would you give to an underclassman thinking about trying out for the dance team next year? Definitely don't get discouraged or give up. It takes a lot of practice to get to a point where you want to be, and you will always be working harder, so just don't give up. Okay, and what drew you to come back to the dance team? 
definitely football season every single year is the best part. And how much time do you say that you spend practicing outside of practice? Only when I have to. <laughs> and what's your favorite part of being a part of the dance team? Um, getting to have such good friendships with all the other girls on the team and always having a support system. All right. Well, this was our Athlete Elite, Lakin. Thank you, Lakin. Thank you. The cheer and dance team went to UCA and UDA this summer where they placed in multiple things. The first pep rally is tomorrow, so don't go to the gym until call. We don't want to see Dr. Slater's anger face. Also, tomorrow is your first Wetumpka football game where we will play the Prattville Lions at 7 p.m. Catch us there. That's it for Sports Talk. One. Hey, guys, look. Where? I don't see anything. That camera right there. What camera? The camera. Oh! oh hey, hey good to see you there. Hey, guys, I'm Morgan. I'm Jamaris. I'm Liz. And this and is Entertainment. What are you supposed to say? Just I don't really know what to say. It. I mean, it's not like it's for the whole school to see or anything. Okay. Well, Morgan, mm -hmm. just say something funny. Something funny? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I got you. Liz, <laughs> you got me dead. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. It's really okay. Well, I guess um, we're going to let him sleep, and yeah. thanks for enjoying our clip of the day. Thanks for watching.